Hey guys, welcome to another episode of my new 1v1 series. It's where I uh, take, I guess for now the the theme is uh, current day versus historical, but I am willing to go beyond that and, uh, you know, just do whatever matchup I find to be interesting. But today I'm going to do um, another modern day versus historical. And this one is going to have the theme of my home country. It's going to be Andrew Bogut versus Luke Longley. And um, I think this is an interesting little rivalry because uh, Andrew Bogut came into the NBA. I'm, by the way, I'm going to be controlling Luke Longley, hopefully. Um, see if I can, or at least I want to control Luke Longley. Maybe I have to go back. Okay, Luke Longley, Team 1. Like, you know, I, I don't really have a preference here, but I tend to like to uh, go for the underdog, and in this case I think Longley is the underdog, because I, I think um, Bogut's more skilled than what Longley was. Not taking anything away from Luke, but yeah. That's just my opinion. Um, so, when Bogut first came into the league, he said that he essentially called uh, Luke Longley a stiff, and said that he was much... Uh, you know, much more athletic than Longley and all that kind of stuff. You know, it wasn't wasn't that respectful, I suppose, but um so yeah, and Luke Longley responded with, you know, actions kind of speak louder than words and you know, you haven't really done anything in the NBA yet, so whoa. So yeah. I thought it was an interesting little matchup. It's something that it's one that I won't be able to cheese out on very much because oh because neither can really shoot from beyond the three so it's going to be a lot of posting up oh oh jeez long bogut about time you got one in um it's going to be a lot of post up a lot of post-up action like this, and, um, oh, beautiful. So it's going to be a lot different from my, um, Steph Curry, Del Curry video. <sighs> oh, oh, what? Okay, let's post him up. Let's move. S yeah, it was good. It was beautiful. G okay, I can't continue to back off like that. That's my, um, that's like my move. That's my, um, NBA Live 10 cheese move where I... Yeah, my NBA Live cheese move where I back off, looking for the block, hoping that I can swat away their layup. I can't do this against Bogut though, because he can dunk. And I can't... I can't hit threes with Longley. Or at least I'm, I'm assuming I can't hit threes with Longley. Oh, I'll beat you there, son. So, you know, for the record, I'm actually a big fan of um, Andrew Bogut. I'm, I'm a fan of Luke Longley as well. So... You know, I don't... I don't hold what um, Bogut said against him at all. Like, I... You know... When people are young, they say stupid things. So, I put 
what Bogut said down to youthful indiscretion, maybe not knowing, you know, how, you know, what he should actually say when he's confronted by media, and, you know, so anyway, you know, I'm just, I'm rambling on a tangent here, I should really focus on this game a bit. Yeah. I'm probably going to be like Joust Ming and I'm not going to win a single game in this series. But, you know, this, it's a, it's a fun mode. I, r I really like this blacktop mode. I like one-on-one. -on -one. <sighs> I don't like that. See if I can cheese. Oh, that wasn't too far off. At least hit the hoop. Me playing some Matador defense once again. Ole. Oh. Luke Longley, if you're watching this, I I apologize. Except for that, that was a that was a sweet move, you know. Luke Longley would be happy for me to do that move. Not that long, that one though, you know. Uh, this is why I take the underdog character, because I kind of suck at this game, and oh. Ho, ho, can I get a replay of that one? Or is... <sighs> no, I can't. Damn, that was such a sweet dunk too. Hopefully it'll show in the highlight package at the end. Chase it down. Good on you, Luke. Good hustle, kid. Okay, post up. Oh, bogut. I hate that. I I wish I wish they could just, you know, go back to half court after they block a shot. Don't think it's fair that they can kind of do that. Yes, go back. You didn't take get a finger on that one. Oh, damn you. How, since when has Bogut had that kind of range? I mean, maybe you used to, but... You know... His elbow isn't what it used to be. He's... <sighs> I'm being schooled. <laughs> I've done nothing for Luke Longley's case. Except prove that maybe Bogut had a point. God, that was a brick. Major, major brick. Okay. Stay on him, Luke. How did he work me off that much? Come on, what you got, what you got? Oh, come on, I wanted that to be a poster. That was good defense. I'm I'm happy with that I contested that shot well enough. Give me a break. Come on.
Yay! This feels really awkward playing this with a 7 2 center. Oh my goodness! <laughs> oh my god! That was a sick dunk. That was unbelievable. Okay, so the game is over. Let's see if we can get some... Not going to get any highlights from Luke. Okay, we'll get some from Bogut. Ugh. I don't know whether it's my computer or whether NBA 2K's, you know, replay system is really as broken as everybody says it is, but there's, um, there's some parts where it kind of, the player is in one space and then he kind of, well, like that. It's really, I don't know. Is that something 2K has to fix? I've, or just as, or is it just my computer? I don't know. So that uh, concludes another episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I will probably come back with another one pretty soon. I don't know who I'm going to select. I'm not going to do like Jordan versus Kobe or Jordan versus LeBron. I, I want to keep superstars out of this because I'm not going to do them any justice at all. So yeah, I'm going to keep it to um, role players, um, fringe all-stars like Bogut. Well, Bogut was a fringe all-star at one stage. Um, so yeah, if you want to see, I don't know, Greg Steamsma versus Adam Morrison, I'll do it. Just, uh, if anybody's watching this, suggest a matchup between two epic role players, and I will try and play it out. Anyway.